Hi, this is Louis Gusser Jr. and you're watching Celebrity Profile Entertainment. Keep watching. Nice to meet you. Nice Pleasure to meet, to meet you. you. Is this a camera? Yes, it is. I know that girl. With that, you should see the girl behind that camera. You can smile. <laughs> She's a happy lady. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us what you're nominated for. It's today. a faith-based movie. I've been drawn to those movies. Uh, the least among you is one of the first. The first one was uh, Left Behind, for the President of the United States. But it's something that is like a sponge. Everybody's going to those stories. And the stories are so important for us to learn by. Those are original lessons, you know. And uh, The Least Among You is a, a true story. And uh, I, I, I tied up with some, some wonderful people. It's a wonderful thing to do, to say the words of a faith-based movie. Because it takes you, it, you, you take it personally. It improves your life. So it seems like it was the right thing to do, so I continue to do those. What else do you have going on for the year? I have a foundation. When it first came out, it was persona non grata, it was boycotted. It's called e-racism. Now everybody's talking about it. There's no such thing as somebody being superior to another. We cannot get along without one another. Uh, and especially in this country, with the concept that we hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, um, the, the, the Pledge of Allegiance, we have to live by those things that are already written by our forefathers. We have to have compassion for one another. So the work is not just the African-American or the minority, but it's on both sides. The myths, all the stuff that we talk about in the kitchens, in the bedroom, got to put them out in the open and throw them out the window. Because we can't survive without one another these days. And the closer we get, as a people in this country, the more we can reassume our, our position of being one, number one in the world. But until we clean up our own backyard, we're going to have the troubles like we're having today. And the foundation teaches the young people how to do that before they get old. The way it used to be done in, in the good old days, before we went out the door, we had to have be dressed properly, we had to have respect for our elders, our respect for our opposite sex, we had to learn how to get along with one another, we had to have hygiene, spiritual fitness, before we went out the door, and that stopped. So my foundation hopefully restores that to our young people, to so learn how to get along with one another. What's the website? Huh? The website. E-Racism, the word racism, put an E in front of it, eracismfoundation.org. It's a pleasure meeting you, Lewis.